Many people who are facing separation with their twin flame or their twin flame has got married generally ask this question that will my twin flame contact me again? We will try to answer this question in this video and stay tuned to know about a free tool to connect with the soul aspect of your twin flame. Let's take example of a real twin flame couple Tinku and Tina to answer this question. If you want to know more about this couple then you can see video series whose link is given in the cards above. As mentioned in previous videos, Tinku and Tina got separated due to stress that was being caused by their existing partners. Both of them wanted to meet each other but the situation was not allowing for it. Tinku wanted to know that will Tina contact him again or will he be able to see or talk to Tina again. When all of this was going on, Tinku took a reading from tarot card reader and he came to know that Tinku and Tina will reunite after 10 years. This was further shocking for him. Tinku had already started his inner work but the duration of 10 years for reunion seemed too much to him. Tinku told his spiritual master about the tarot card reading. His master who is a spiritual mystic just smiled and told Tinku that anything is possible with inner work. Master asked him to continue on the path of inner work and with his change in vibration Tinku will be able to attract Tina much faster. Tinku kept on doing inner work and his awareness shifted into higher state. While getting separated, Tinku thought that he will not be able to see Tina anymore. But it turned out that as he kept on doing inner work and healing himself, Tina used to appear before him accidentally. One day, Tinku was going to withdraw some money from let's say X bank. And on his way to this bank, there was another bank named Y bank. When he reached near Y bank, he felt like stopping there and go to this bank. So he stopped and went inside Y bank. When he was entering the bank, he saw Tina inside bank who was just getting ready to leave the bank. They both talked to each other like nothing unpleasant has happened between them before. They spoke for a few minutes and then they went their own ways. When Tina left, Tinku thought about his master's word and realized that universe made him visit this bank whereas his original plan was to go to some other bank. Although it was a brief meeting but it made him realize that his separation period does not mean a totally no contact period. This realization felt like a big relief and he felt that his inner work is working. Tinku felt motivated and healed with this development. Universe showed him some higher energy clearing techniques that can further speed up inner work process. He started the practice of these tools regularly and on the 10th day of practicing these tools, he saw that Tina has joined the same gym as him. This was their second meeting and they met briefly. Note here that Tina's partner was also there at the gym, so Tinku kept her distance from Tina. Tina hoped to see same old loving Tinku, but Tinku kept distance from her as their existing partner's situation was not resolved yet. Although Tinku wanted to talk to her, but he realized that it's better to keep on doing inner work instead of creating further stress due to the existing partners. Tinku understood that his inner work and energy clearing is working as he can clearly see the results. But he also needs to do more inner work to get himself and Tina free from their existing partners. This meeting was a great realization and Tinku got motivated to try further higher inner work techniques and energy clearing techniques. Tinku was doing healing for both himself and Tina. Tina was also shedding old energy very fast. So after a couple of more months of inner work and higher energy clearing, Tina had a vision about their past birth together. She messaged Tinku on social media about the experience and Tinku received guidance to meet Tina and let her know about what is going on. So they met at a cafe where Tinku told Tina about inner work and energy clearing but he also told her that he will not come back to her until the existing partner issue is completely resolved on both sides. Note here that although Tinku wanted to get back with Tina but Tinku knew that he have to do inner work to such a point that all external factors that are opposing them are neutralized completely. 
This news was devastating for Tina, but it also propelled her in journey to learn higher in her work. She took a big step and went ahead to become a yoga teacher, which is also a form of inner work. Divine's plan needed that she becomes a yoga teacher and thus guide others to balance their lifestyles. There were other synchronicities that were happening as Dinku was progressing in his inner work. Universe was keeping them in touch by one way or another. In some cases, someone would refer about Tina in front of Dinku and thus Dinku will get a chance to know that whether he has resolved all uneasiness or is there any uneasiness still left regarding Tina and her partner. Sometimes Tinku will see Tina's name on some advertisement board or in a television program. Sometimes Tinku will see a dream of Tina that will indicate that she is also rising higher in her inner world. Sometimes her picture will pop up in some social media post or a reference to her may pop up somewhere. And sometimes while going on the road, Tinku might see Tina coming toward him, but she just passes him. After doing inner work for a couple of years, Tinku sought master spirit guidance to know the date and time of reunion and he came to know that it will take four more years. This was another shock that he had already done inner work for a couple of years and now divine guidance is saying that it will still take four more years. When he told this to his master, then his master recommended him to better focus on his higher purpose than to seek answer for reunion time. The more Tinku was focusing on reunion day, the more he was sending this signal in universe that he is currently not with Tina or he is missing Tina. First, Tinku have to reach a spiritual state where he can feel Tina always with him energetically. This was his last test and he learned his lesson. He completely removed his focus back from reunion date and instead focused on his higher purpose. And the good news is that soon after he passed this test, universe started to increase their frequency of chance meetings. Tinku's relation with his partner had changed from partners to friends. Same happened with Tina and her partner that their relation also changed from being partners to friends. And one day, Dinku accidentally met Tina when she was walking alone on roadside. It was a brief meeting and Tinku told her that he has started teaching inner work to any willing students. Tina asked Tinku that how will his partner respond if Tina comes to learn inner work from Tinku. Tinku had no answer to this question at that time. He asked the same question from his partner and to his surprise, his partner said that she don't have any objections if Tinku is teaching inner work to Tina or anyone else. In couple of weeks that day came when Tinku got this guidance during a meditation that he can call Tina today. He was surprised that it came out of nowhere. He was a little nervous too, but he took the step and called Tina. As per divine's will, Tina came to meet Tinku within 10 minutes of the call. And then they spoke their heart out and it was a great healing day for both of them. This was new development and Tinku offered to teach inner work to Tina as he knew that Tina had some inner work that needs to be done before they can be in complete harmony and free from other attachments. Tina was happy to see Tinku and learning inner work was her only option to see Tinku again. Tina started learning inner work taught by Tinku and slowly she raised her vibration to a much higher level. This is called harmonious reunion. When Tina was also able to understand that the whole purpose of separation phase was to prepare both of them for higher teachings. Now she takes responsibility for all painful or unpleasant events that happen in her life instead of looking out for solution or support from others. Obviously, Tinku is helping her in healing any triggers because he has more experience in dealing with them and the blessing of their spiritual master is always with them. They practically learned about the pain that other twin flames are going through and they started to guide other twin flames in the process of reunion. Many of our students have united in a similar way to their twin flames and they are now helping their counterpart in inner work and soon these twin flame couples will be guiding other twin flames all across the planet. So, the summary is that although when separation process was happening, it seemed to Tinku and Tina that they might not meet again soon and thus they were feeling helpless. But with proper guidance from spiritual master and with discipline and firm resolve, universe supported this twin flame couple in meeting many times by accident and finally they were able to get back to each other in harmony. So if you are asking this question that will my twin flame contact me again, then the answer is that it depends on your inner work. 
बट येस सुनर और लेटर यू विल गेट कनेक्टेड टू योर ट्विन फ्लेम इन अ वे दैट इधर दे विल कॉन्टेक्ट यू और यू विल गेट गाइडेंस टू कॉन्टेक्ट दम अगेन इफ यू आर डूइंग योर इनर वर्क If you have any questions or comments about this topic or you can share your experience with us then please leave the comment in the comment section of this video to get notification about our free meditation session and our upcoming inner work program you can join our telegram channel link of telegram channel and link of our programs can be found in the description of this video to watch upcoming video you can subscribe to our youtube channel and you can click the bell icon to get a notification whenever we upload a new video thank you so much for watching and we see you next time